guys, I'm here with a Timu haul. Wanted to go ahead and show you guys what I got. Um, actually, some of it was part of a the program that I'm in. It's uh, basically a it's their affiliate like their affiliate program that they have for uh, YouTubers. But um, some of the items that I got was just basically that I was allowed a credit and I went ahead and picked out what I wanted. I went ahead and ordered this um, cool portable mini fruit blender. It is pink. It's not this color orange, but I'm really looking forward to doing that. And um, I was thinking like smoothies in the morning. Also, sometimes I just like salsa and I think I'm going to try to do a review and see if it might even chop up some just some salsa because I like chips and salsa quite a bit but um, just like fresh, I like it fresh. So I was wondering if I could try this for that as well, but I'm gonna go ahead and do a review, show you guys um, how this ends up working, but that kind of gives you an idea of what it looks like, except it is pink, so it's kind of like the color of this box in a way, but um, it charges wirelessly, it's waterproof, it has a rechargeable battery, um, so yeah, I'm really excited, and of course, like I, that's the color of it right here, ah, duh. There it is. But yeah, I'm really excited to try this out and I'm happy that I got this. Thank you, Timu, for allowing me to purchase this. And I'm gonna go ahead and show you guys the rest of the items that I got. So this also I was able to get from them. The box is a little bit kind of looking scary, but um, I did open it and it's fine. It's a lighting thing that I can use under my cabinet. So I do have a cabinet that's kind of dark and this is really cool. It's an intelligent light. So you're able to use it. Um, it I believe it has like a sensor of some sort in it. And again, this will all be, I'll be doing a review of this as well. Um, but let's see if I can open it really quick so you guys can kind of see because the box doesn't show you anything. I'll show you guys, basically that's kind of the gist of it there. And it's just, it's simple, but you can attach it to maybe the bottom of the cabinet. And then it has like this little USB connector so that you can charge it. And um, the only thing they say is it charge it ahead of time before you use it. But yeah, that's kind of an idea there. And I thought it was gonna be really cool for my cabinet because I really, I do have a cabinet that I just can't see for the life of me. Um, I don't know if it'll work for me right now because it is, it hasn't been charged. Whoa, whoa brightness. <laughs> Sorry if I blinded you guys. So yeah, that kind of gives you an idea. Um, so I'll stop playing with it, but that kind of gives you an idea of what this is like and it's super bright and it's LED. So I'm looking forward to using this item. And definitely my cabinet could really use it because there's times when I'm just like, I have to actually use a flashlight in there and it's kind of crazy. Um, the other thing I did get on my own was this cute little fox net, uh, ring. I know I've told you guys that I like to buy um, little cutesy rings and I prefer little animal items like brooches and that sort of thing. So that was my latest purchase and he was only like a dollar something. And no, I mean, it's not like gold or anything, but if you take care of them, you can use them. I just take them off when I'm going to wash my hands and stuff. And if I know I'm going to be like doing a lot of major stuff, I just take it off. I have a little ring holder. But yeah, that is my little ring. Cute little ring. Little fox. And it is resizable. Okay, the other item that I got for um, basically free for me, so is this one and this one, and then this one, it's after Christmas, and I had gotten this before Christmas, but, um, sorry for the unwrapping, but it's a cute little banner of a snowman, and again, I'll show you guys uh, a little quick review of this at, at some point, but it's a cute little banner that I used, and it's uh, weatherproof. So you're able to put it outside and that's kind of what I did with it. But um, I'll show you guys a picture at some point and do a separate little quick review of it. Um, and then the rest, let's see. I got this cool stuff for my card making. I have like cute little um, 
like a little animal jungle theme. Also, I have brand new sloths that I can use this uh, greenery with. Uh, remember the sloths I hauled from Global Land that my friend gave me for Christmas? Um, well, kind of Christmas. Um, I'm going to go ahead and make a cute little card, and I think that this ribbon will be perfect for it. And it's just basically, I don't know if it looks like satin. I would have to go back and check, but I believe it's satin uh, greenery ribbon, whatever. So yeah, I'm looking forward to using this. This is going to be really fun. And again, Timo has really, really good prices, guys. And nine, most of the time, I don't think, because I've shopped there several times already, and I don't believe they have shipping. So this was obviously free because I had gotten this stuff, but um, I don't believe they charge shipping most of the time if you catch it on a good time. And um, the only catch with Timo is if you load your cart, you have to probably buy it right away because things change. So they have like limited supply. And just because, you know, you got it and put it in your cart and let it sit doesn't mean you're going to come back to that same cart. So some things might disappear on you. So that's the only catch with Timo. So you have to watch that. This is just a die for um it's supposed to be a poinsettia and i did get it i got it in time but i didn't end up using it this year but i think it'll make a really pre pretty poinsettia but really honestly you could just make it a plain old flat flower too it doesn't have to be a poinsettia so yeah i think it's going to be nice and then this is the largest size here so that's a good size flower of course you would layer it so yeah That'll be pretty, and I'm looking forward to using that. I don't know if I hold these for you guys already. This was kind of slipped in into the Timu stuff, so I don't know if I showed you guys this. But basically, I have a hard time um, handling little teeny tiny items, and I figured this would come in handy to use those. So there's just kind of little... Um, uh, pliers that I can kind of grab things. Tweezers. Pliers. Tweezers. And um, I just thought the color was also pretty, like a Tiffany blue. But yeah, so it's two different ones. One with like the curved, and then the other one's like an end, like a straight edge. So yeah, and I'm just going to use those for like the little teeny tiny dies and teeny tiny things that you end up using, especially in card making and scrapbooking. I was going to unwrap this, but I'm not going to. This is a net, basically. I'm just going to use it for like my, um, like I have a fish uh, beach scenes, fish scenes, ocean stuff. And I think this would come in handy to just kind of put like in a background of a card. So there's that. And then of course I did haul some of these wooden ornaments and, um, there are, oh gosh, I can't remember. I believe it's, I feel like it's 20, but I'm not sure. And I use some of them. So I don't remember exactly, but there's quite a few. Look at that. And it's wooden, and they're, um, they do have little holders, little twine in there as well. And what I did with these, and I'll show you guys if I think about it, um, I put a doggy, like my dog's names on it, and then the little paws, and then those were hung. So that is what I use these for, and then these extra ones, I don't know, I might create something. I'm thinking about doing a Grinch tree next year, so I might go ahead and just do like Grinch uh, theme items on this, maybe get stickers, and maybe I could do like a um, decoupage type deal on them or something, I don't know, but they're decent wooden pieces, uh, round, Sorry again, guys. I know you hate the rattling, but I don't. So it's decent chipboard, basically, or whatever. I don't know what this is, but it's wood. That's what it says, wood. So, yeah, and I like them. They're nice, and they have a nice little handle. And then I actually didn't, I didn't use the twine. I used a red ribbon on each one of mine. But, yeah, thought these were cute. And then also, even, like, if you're, like, a teacher or something, you could use these for your classroom. And Timu, again, the prices are super good, so it's like you're not you're not paying all kinds for, um, you know, supplies. As it is, you guys, you know, poor teachers, they have to use their own money. Don't get me started on that. I'm not a teacher, but I have a lot of friends that are teachers, and I know what they go through. Um, but yeah. Anyways, I'm going to get off that. <laughs> 
Check this out, guys. Isn't that cute? It's Superman and Super, no, uh, Wonder Woman. So Wonder Woman and Superman. Isn't that adorable? I love it. Let's see if I can, um, you can see it better this way. Aren't they cute? I love it. And the sentiments are cute too. You are wonderful. You're a wonder. Never underestimate the power of really cool boots. Get well faster than a speeding bullet. And then it says mom, which I don't know. You could say mom, you're a wonder or mom, have a super day or whatever. You're a real life superhero for this one. Have a super day. This would be really cute for like a dad card, like maybe Father's Day. That would be cute. And then this one for mom or maybe someone who's into, um, you know, Superman or Wonder Woman. I can think of a couple of people. I know one offhand from YouTube, Miss um, Twisted Gypsy. <laughs> she loves Wonder Woman. So yeah, I just thought this was super cute. And I believe this was like it was under $3. It was like $2 and change. So I love it. And I've already told you guys the stamps from um, Timu are great. They're awesome. So yeah, that's, that's one that I hauled as well. And then let's see. One last final thing. I showed you guys the snowflakes that I had um, hauled. I also fell in love with these cute little flowers. These are, I think, nail art. I think they're supposed to be for nail art. But I got them for my cards. Aren't they pretty? And I think these will be perfect for the spring. You know, all the cute little pastel colors. And then if you look closely, I don't know if that's going to focus. Hopefully it'll focus. See that? The cute little, um, there's silver little dots. There's gold little dots that you can use also for the flowers. Like with my cute little tweezers that I now have, I can get the little gold dot and glue it to the top of the flower and we'll be good to go. Aren't they cute? I love them. The purple is so pretty and the pink. All of them are pretty. And they did have like primary colors, but I have a lot of primary colored stuff. I don't have a lot of pastel, so I wanted to go ahead and get my pastel on, especially now, you know, with Easter coming up and the springtime coming up, it'll be perfect for that. And again, this was not very expensive. I don't remember exactly how much it was, but majority of the Timu stuff that I hauled was right under $2. Some of it was even a, under a dollar. Um, I don't remember how much the juicer was, but of course, like I said, I got the credit for this to go ahead and buy it. So um, I honestly can't tell you, but if you looked it up, I know that they had it on there the last time I was on the site. So definitely check it out if you're interested. And like I said before, guys, I am going to do a review of the juicer itself. I'm excited to try it out and I'll go ahead and show you guys how that works. I'll show you how the light works. I'll show you how my banners came out and then... I don't know, I might even show you guys a card or two of this, um, these cute little um, stamps. But yeah, I hope you all are doing good. Have a good day. Happy New Year, by the way, because I didn't say that earlier in my last video. But I'll talk to you guys soon. Bye-bye. Make sure you check out Timu. Bye.